This Albion clan Kelly business leaves a bad taste in my mouth. And if Caitlin Lau's right, then this little nugget jumps to the front of the queue. We have reason to believe a former dead sec operative may still be alive, but missing inside the EPC. Angel Lopez, not London born, but I won't hold that against him, unlike some others. Looks like Angel got caught up in the immigration roundup, which, ironically, may be the only reason he escaped Zero Day's dead sec purge. Anti-immigrant sentiment has grown in London since the bombings. Albion fuels it. It allows them to send anyone they want to their brutal refugee camp. We need to find Angel before they discover he's dead sec. This is kind of personal team. But finding his trail might just shed some light on the Albion clan Kelly connection. Raph, I wouldn't want to spend a minute trapped in the EPC. And one of our family dead sec is in there. We better get him out. I've sent the details to your device and advised our contact at the EPC. They can get you inside. So, I've delved more into Caitlin Lau's investigation, and an enormous number of missing person cases center around the EPC. The inspector was definitely onto something. Let's go find our contact. Who knows what those Albion bastards will do to Angel if they learn his dead sack. Bagley summons. I've already taken care of your entry. Get you in quick and quiet. This is on the down low, right? I need to drift in and out like a doppy. No worries. I'll spoof. But come meet me on the rooftop. The only place here that doesn't smell like piss. Got some info for you. Oh. 
European Processing Center. It processes deportees by stacking them up in squalid conditions and forgetting about them. But hey, it's to protect London, right? Don't do anything you'll regret. on here this place is worse than a prison camp every day i see people come through here torn from their homes and their families but i'd rather stay and keep our eye on things maybe help out once in a while like no disgusting the government is treating so-called illegals like rabid dogs they could shoot anyone here dump them in at the thames and no one would know yeah well people have been disappearing records say they have been processed but it doesn't add up no one ever properly leaves. And with the Kellys prowling around like fucking hyenas, I am not too optimistic about the people slipping through the cracks. Of course that Mary Kelly bitch and her clowns are part of this. How could they resist something so shady? Truth. Now, about your missing guy, the best place to start would be the EPC database. They keep a record of everyone that comes in. And be careful. Pushing the location of the EPC database on your optic. There will be a database here that we can search for evidence on Angel Lopez.
Badly. Tell me you found something. I have. His file has been deleted from the main database, along with hundreds of others. Still very detailed. Even when committing crimes against humanity, the government doesn't skip on paperwork. Here is a recording labelled Exit Interview. You know what we do with terrorists, Lopez? Ah, uh, don't go pissing me off by denying anything. We know you're with DedSec. I think you were picked up on some random sweep. Not a fucking chance. Nothing to say. Hmm. Well, this is not gonna go well for you then, because I want information. The rest of your cell, where are they? I want names, places, everything you've got. You think I'm daft? I spill everything I know and what? You let me go? I'm not talking. I know how this ends. Oh, I don't think you do. I'm going to throw you to the wolves. The Kellys have an interesting way of disposing with problems. You think I'm scared of some fucking thugs? Of winding up floating in the dams? Fuck you! You're too pretty for that, mate. <laughs> First, they'll peddle you. For Dosh, right? Then, when you're used up, they're going to chop you up and send the pieces to the Four Corners. I can take whatever you've got. I almost feel sorry for you. Get him to the bloody clinic, then. Shit. They knew he was dead sick the whole time. This doesn't look good for Angel. The clinic keeps government service hours, which means it's closed. We'll have to find Angel the old-fashioned way and hack their CTOS hub. Deportation limbo, horrible living conditions, unexplained disappearances. It's almost as if the media are deliberately ignoring the situation here in favor of... Oh, look here, Beatrice Stokely, 89, recently took up kickboxing to fill up her days. Fascinating. If the EPC is a typical example of how humans treat each other, I'd say a benevolent AI overlord is a step up, wouldn't you? Shut them out, Bagley.
I have reconstructed an AR scene of Angel's examination. You can view it inside the clinic. Nicely done. CTOS AR. Data reconstruction in progress. Let's make a deal, yeah? I know people outside. Maybe I can help you out. J just let me out of here. Procedures, Mr. Lopez. We'll have you out of here in a minute or two. Ah! Fuck! What was that? Looks like they gave him an implant. We should dig deeper on this. Facial analysis matches for both. They're part of Mary Kelly's little pack. So, Inspector Lau was right after all. Clank Kelly and Albion are in bed together. What a shit orty that would be. Microchips, coated with biocompatible glass to prevent rejection. They put a microchip in Angel. For what? Tracking? Genetic modification? No, these are more sophisticated. If I had to guess, I would say they were designed to deliver a dose of some unknown compound. Not the kind of thing you find at your local corner shop. I could reconstruct the path he took if you want to see how this cliffhanger gets resolved. Follow him. I'm praying he got away. Catching up on him. Come on, Angel. Oh, oh shit! He's gonna make it. Coming, and clearly the microchip wasn't a tracking device. Somehow it activated. Angel might be alive though. Whatever the fuck Mary Kelly's up to, he might still be alive. We need to find him, see what they did to him, and what that fucking microchip is all about. Seems like advanced technology for Mary Kelly and her band of thugs to be waving around. 
could Mary be part of a scary dark web hacker group like, say, oh, I don't know, pick one, Zero Day? Interesting theory, Bagley, but hold your investigation algorithms for the moment, will you? Angel needs us. The incinerator they mentioned is probably the Southern incinerator. It's practically right around the corner. Ehe, looks like we got a real handle on this DedSec business. You wouldn't have been recruited if DedSec thought you'd be killed that easily. Me don't know whether to thank you or slap your head, Bagley. Don't let Bagley get under your skin. Job well done. This is where the Kelly's brought Angel? Lot of mercy! I'm getting major red flags! Now, now, keep your chin up. We'll find him. There's a camera network that might have caught where they took him. and access that network, shall we? Bitch. 
Time to pick up where your teammate left off. I'm sure they'll thank you once they stop eating through a tube. Bastards. I hope they subscribe to an eye for an eye, because I do. Let's hurry and access that network, shall we? you often have in London. That's our play then. sealed, but this rubbish chute might do. It either leads to the cellar or your grisly death. Or both, I suppose. Fantastic. you come on I heard you too well get over here
thanks for the distraction. Gave me the second I needed to take care of this filth. You okay? That guy looked ready to seriously fuck your day up. He was. I'm fine. I just need a second to catch my breath and find my files. Wait, you're Caitlin Lau. Caitlin Lau, the police inspector. We saw your videos. You must be raving mad to go after Mary Kelly on your own. It wasn't always on my own. Who the hell are... You're dead sick, aren't you? You tracked me to the slaughterhouse. Not exactly. We're tracking a friend who vanished from the EPC. The trail led here. It's horrible thinking that all those missing people ended up here, ended up like this. Then I'm sorry. I don't think there's much hope for finding him alive. The Kellys have got a sick little operation going. A kind of human organ black market. I've been investigating them for months. And they got my fucking files. God, I feel like shit. You need some rest. Someone on the team will come and get you, bring you somewhere safe. I'll find Angel and your files. But I need to know what's on them. Everything I've gathered on Mary Kelly. Almost enough to take her down. Well, shit. We should be working together anyway. After this, Dead Sec will need to dig a little deeper into Mary Kelly. All right, an operative is on their way to escort Inspector Lau. So, let's find Angel and Inspector Lau's files. I'll wait for your guy in here. And... For your help. I'm glad we're doing it. There's no doubt about it. This whole operation is meant to harvest organs. Clan Kelly's chopping off the parts they want and burning the leftovers. Only none of them were willing donors, were they? Mary Kelly has a lot to answer for. Oh, fuck. Their faces are just... mutilated. Bagley, could you run some kind of facial reconstruction? This is not good. Take a picture and I can run key details past various databases. Negative. Clan Kelly needs to pay for this. Mary Kelly needs to pay. No one else should have to suffer this horrible butchery. Unfortunately, I must confirm that this is indeed Angel Lopez. He knew the risks. I did too, but... Never thought DedSec would get caught up in this. Mary Kelly is preying on London's most vulnerable. She's a fucking monster. Taking her out needs to be a DedSec priority. Now we need to find Caitlin Lau's case files on Mary Kelly and see if my conjecture may be correct. Could Mary Kelly be in zero day? No one's here. You got the files. The inspector will be impressed. Now get out of here before someone decides to turn you into minced meat. Chop chop. No kidding.
Dead sec? Caitlin Lau here. I uh, wanted to thank you. I'd be nothing but an anatomy lesson by now. Or a pile of ashes. You'll be happy to know that Inspector Lau has been escorted to a nearby refuge and is getting her wounds treated. I'll be fine. Still a little flighty from whatever they gave me. And frankly, a little stunned that we've joined forces. Damn, never thought Dead Set would partner up with a cop. Or, well, an ex cop even. But whatever it takes to stop Mary Kelly from doing this shit to others. Exactly. You have an organization, I have information, and some backing from powerful people. Pool our resources, and we might just take her down. Mary Kelly's no petty criminal. Bagley, rally everyone to the safe house. We need to go over these files and establish a plan. I'll sync with Inspector Lau and prepare a briefing. I've heard from Inspector Lau. We're ready for the briefing. Kelly heads up the most powerful crime family in London, Clan Kelly, which should at least be easy to remember. Under her old man, they were a bit player. Then he died, and her rivals started disappearing. Her enemies, her friends, her family. They call her Bloody Mary for a reason. Early on, Mary abandoned cash in favor of cryptocurrency and brought the Kelly's criminal business online. It makes weapons smuggling, drug running, money laundering all a lot easier without a cash trail. The woman single-handedly modernized organized crime in London. She considers herself to be untouchable. Case in point, from my files you retrieved. Darla Covington, 19. Sasha Haddad, 28. Radek Stopkovich, 24. All disappeared. It's difficult to find good help these days, isn't it, love? Most people, they ain't driven. Not like you. Because they feel worthless, don't they? The way that the world is, how it uses people. It's horrible. It's nice that you have a purpose. Oh, that'll be me, love. We aren't finished here. This... was a courtesy. Give my regards to their families. It's horrible losing someone you love. Nice meeting you, Caitlin. As you can see, she'll never respond to interrogation. But there is one place she feels comfortable talking. The Sandstone Residence. Inspector Lau thinks a police bug in the Kelly's headquarters may have the evidence she needs to finally convict Bloody Mary. Sandstone is their center of operations. I know the data on that bug will take her down. Get it for me, and I swear I'll put her away forever. Pushing the coordinates to your optics. Sabine here, Inspector Lau. I'm curious how you think you can bring Mary Kelly to justice now, with no backing. Even before Albion took over policing, you couldn't lock her up. And she goes on treating humans like cattle. I had to work within the system. Yes, it was corrupt. I knew it. I just didn't know how bad it was. I thought a strong enough case couldn't be buried. Well, you were wrong. After all, power tends to corrupt. Why do you think it would be different this time? Because I'm taking it to a contact in the Attorney General's office. An honest solicitor with a hard-on for organized crime, specifically for Mary Kelly. Look, our methods may differ, but I want to help those people as much as you do. All right. But however this goes down, there's no way we're letting Mary slip the net again. That's not how DedSec does things. Let's get to Sandstone. Feeling ready to fight? <laughs> when am I not? Security here is state-of-the-art, quite impenetrable. Unless, of course, you flew a drone through the window one of Mary's mouth breathers left open. The recording device is in her security room. Getting there should be a simple matter of navigating the vents. What a rasp! 
She's using these people as house servants, against their will. Horrible in itself, but a million times worse knowing they end up as unwilling organ donors. See what kind of recording we've got on her. Just look at this place. This is what comes of old crooked money. The Kelly family has been profiting from people's misery for a long time. She's got this shit all over the manor. So you've been in there before? Is that how you ended up in the basement of the Southwark incinerator? We needed something incriminating, so we decided someone had to get in here and plant a bug. I wasn't going to assign someone else to do that. You saw how Mary uses the people she grabs out of the EPC, and the staff's uniform's not hard to mimic, so I went in. What I didn't know was that she had intel on our investigation, my team. I thought going off book would stop the leaks, but she still knew we were coming. She tortured me for the names of my team, tried to break me, but cops don't give up cops. Turned out she already knew the whole unit and put hits out on them. <laughs> the woman is a mind fucker. At least she didn't chip your brain. Probably knew you would have rather died than bend to her will. That's how I ended up on that butcher's table. So many reasons to want to rid the world of her, but it wouldn't be enough to just put one in her brain. My mates died trying to bring her to justice. I have to honor that.
What have you done to yourself after everything I've done for you? You made me a slave. All of us. Please, let me go. Take this thing out. Back to your old life. Back to nothing. Back to you. 2.5 screaming blighters in your dead end job and sucking off the doll. You don't want that, love. This microchip is scary, I know, but I got to keep tracks on my merchandise, don't I? And this kitchen knife, that won't do it, love. Cutting yourself affects my bottom line. You walk. I can't live like this anymore. No. You are right there. It's all right, sweetheart, because I have another use for you. You know, we good. Be sure and spread the word. You know where this one goes. Get these two and all the others over to the venue and ready for the sale. Right away, ma'am. Also, the foreign investors have already landed and the drones are programmed, ready to deliver the invitations and the coordinates to all the guests. Mm, it's that initiative I'm smelling, Peter. Initiative can be a dangerous thing. Can be misinterpreted. How did Mary get her hands on this kind of tech? It takes a sick mind to come up with killer microchips. Perhaps a diseased mind, but definitely an ingenious one. Perfect psych profile for a group like Zero Day, wouldn't you say? Her affiliations aren't my priority, Bagley. She's keeping these people enslaved. And it sounds as if she's selling them. This is huge. The microchip keeps her slaves in line. If they get too ambitious, zap! She hits them and takes their organs like the cattle. DedSec, we'll have to crash that slave auction. Get all the information we can out of there. The location will be on the invitations. She hasn't sent out the invitation yet, but when she does... Bagley, monitor the drone networks. Give us a heads up when Mary sends out her fleet. Until then, I reckon we're in a holding pattern. I'll get in touch if I hear about anything else that might interest you. Cheers, DedSec.